Oh no, I fucked it already! Shit! Mark's a motherfucking renegade! Hello! <laughs> Welcome back to How to Game with Mark! Yep, wee! Mark the Muppet, he's in, he's stuck in a closet this time, <laughs> not a toilet. <laughs> or refrigerator, I said, did I last time? Did, yeah, on the boat, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We're playing, as you can see, Jack 2 Renegade. It has a weird subtitle only in Europe for some reason. It's really weird. Yeah, so there he is, our little boy Daxter. Do you, do you, oh, those good old times where we played Jack and Daxter. How long ago did we play Jack and Daxter? It's been over a year, isn't it? Over a year. Uh, <laughs> Long time ago, I guess so. Oh. Yeah, yeah. I think it was like two years ago. Yeah. It was. It's probably two, two and a half years ago because it was before. It's back when it was how do you guess and not just how do you game. So uh, yeah, well, yeah. Um, I think yeah, we'll the do... thing about it too is um, the fact that. I was watching you live stream it, just how good you were. I'm like, fuck me, I'm bored. <laughs> oh, here we go. So we've got some... Uh... Do you know who's talking? Can you hear who's talking? Yes. Who's talking? Samos the Sage. Here we are, back in good old Sandover Village. Nice. So, I guess you saw in my live stream, I don't know if you saw the whole thing, but I got 100%. So I did yes, Tony. Yes, I did. So the door at the end opened up. The power cells went out. Count them. Count them all. Quick. Is that the right amount? It's going to open. See, this is another thing. This does actually lead into Jack 2. But we don't even see. Was it always going to be what, what it is in Jack 2? Or... Oh, such a tease. And there's a glowing light. Do you remember that? Yeah. I do, yes. So they found the machine. This machine. Ooh. Not like our playthrough, which was a... <laughs> which, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, talking of our playthrough, Tony, um, how did you do on the um, Crash Bandicoot? Because uh, yeah, I remember when you playing it, it was like... See how long it, I mean, deaths we had when we the three of us played it. Remember when Sheffy spilled the show? I've had but, some experience with What do you mean? I uh, remember you did that um, how do you game like time quest thing and you played Oh you played, yeah like, yeah you beat the game and then Oh, oh you talking about the how like the time quest the time What quest. you talking about time quest the Jack and Daxter? Uh that as well as Crash Bandicoot 1. Oh well Crash 1 I did oh. so much better, I didn't know. <laughs> did, yeah, way better. Yeah, yeah. Jack and Dax, I actually I think I've deleted the footage now because I was like, uh I I live streamed it, there's not much point. Oh my god, what's happening, Mark? We're talking all this and look! No. Demons! <gasps> what does he mean? What the fuck is that? <laughs> Press on the button. Holy shit, it's a rock! Put your hands up, Mark! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, what the fuck? No, I never played this game properly, but I remember seeing it being played. It reminded me a bit of GTA as well. Yeah, it's very GTA. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know, really weirdly, so. What's he mean? So, Samos, did you hear what Samos said? And yourself, Jack. He said, so this is how it happened. That's what he said. Uh, okay. Really weird, right? Um, so basically, when they were making Jack 2, or Jack and Daxter 2, they made another happy platformer game, like the first one. And they took it to testing, and loads of kids like tested it, but they were like, eh, this is boring, I just want to play GTA. And from focus testing, that is why they made Jack 2. Jesus, that's, that's fucking weird, man. Why would they do that, though? Uh, because apparently all the people didn't want platformers at the time, but yeah, so this is literally how it was born from focus testing. So and then now platformers become really popular again. Yeah, I, I would love to Jack and Daxter too. So, but I've, I've, do you find it weird though how everything goes for 180 again? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it, but then they like it again. Like PS2, PS1 era was platforming king, weren't it? Everything. Yeah. 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 FPSs aren't as big as they used to be. Yeah, yeah. I've seen games have become quite popular again. Yeah. I, I know 10 years ago they were really big again, but they're they still popular, but 
Uh, and then you've got Mario and all the other platforms. It's mad yeah. how popular they are still and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Uh, listen to, sorry, listen to Baron Praxis's voice, by the way. My men cannot hold them off if he talks anymore. I will not be remembered as the man who lost this city to those vile creatures. Oh my god, it's Clancy Brown! Uka, Uka! <laughs> <laughs> it's Clancy Brown. Yeah. Good old Naughty Dog. Clancy Brown. I really want to watch um, Highlander. Oh, never seen that. Good. Oh, really good. Really coolly. So at the beginning, um, Daxter said, oh, I'll, I'll get you before you know it. And then it said two years later. <laughs> um, and Daxter, actually, the PSP game takes place in that two years. Really? And it, it ends with him going up in an elevator right to here. It's really cool. Be cool, man. Just this I love the fact they've changed his. Um, I'm gonna right. kill Praxis. See how edgy and dark he is, Mark. I know. What have they changed? Sorry. Uh, design of Jack. Uh, Jack. He's not. His hair was different and stuff. Yeah, they've changed the design of both of them. Really, like that still looks like cooler. I think. He looked a bit. I, I like the way he looked in the previous one, but yeah. Remind me not to piss you off. <laughs> See, it's an adult game now, Mark. <laughs> I'm rated than Tony. I'm guessing the first one was a three plus. This one must be a. Oh, I think it's a twelve. <laughs> Weird. I think it's twelve. Yeah. Uh, auto saving. Yeah. So Jack's talking now. He can. He's a talkie boy. Wee. Here we go. All right. It controls really nicely. This game. It's so like you have all this new modern future stuff and still got. The precursor stuff going on, so yeah, it's really cool. I don't know if there's anything over here. Um, also, you can see there's no eggs everywhere like we used to collect, but look up here. There's an egg. Uh, they're now like super secret. These are they? Yeah. We might find a few hidden around. Yeah, like doing difficult tasks. Yeah, like you said. Yeah, we need to. They're they're hard to find. So strange, man. They're uh, very rare. Yeah, so it's still got platforming in there. It's still got the same... I can still do all the same moves and everything. But then eventually I'll get a gun. <laughs> Look, I know all the secrets, Mark. <laughs> yeah, I can tell, Tony. I don't know what I'm doing. Actually, where do I go from here? I don't know. I walk through the door. I think I have to go up here. No. <laughs> where the freaking hell do I go? Oh, up here. Okay, sure. I know all the secrets, but <laughs> Ooh, that's a high ledge. Cool. Once, so what do you think? I, I, I think so far, what the fact they changed it up. Break that crate. Yeah, I like it. I mean, uh... sorry, go on. I want to see more of the game to kind of like make a proper proper decision. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a cool, cool idea. I think. Oh, what, what happened there? Yeah. Oh, I'm jumping up there. Oh, slowly does it. Maybe if I turned the fucking camera, I would have known where to go. Ooh, that was close. I do like a good old siren sound. Get out of here. Yeah, man. It was easy. They're, so they're called the Crimson Guards. Um, so basically, Baron Praxis runs this city. And these guys are like... They're kind of like... I don't, I, it's not really a dictatorship, it's more like a... I don't really know what you'd call it. But they run this city. Who runs the city? Shit. <laughs> I fucked that up. <laughs> I was trying to sing the... is that the Beyonce song? Oh yeah, who runs the world? Girls, that one. No. Who runs the city? Praxis. Who runs the city? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Terrible rendition. <laughs> ah! I'm under arrest. Mark. Tony. Boom. Get out of here. Oh, they're not even well, shooting me. The fact they kept your um, health the same as it was before as well. You can get a longer jump by rolling into it. Slightly different, but yeah, I think you've got more health in this one than you did in the previous. <laughs> oh no, I fucked it already! Shit! <laughs> in the first one you only had three hit points, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. Oh! God damn it, they're shooting at me! But I need to collect this secret egg I know about. <laughs> I think you can actually miss these eggs. Because um, you never come back to this part of the game. Oh, actually, I might be lying. You might come back here. I can't remember. Uh, where am I? What's going on? I'm drunk. The camera's not agreeing with me. <laughs> 
So if, the, if there was a game, you would... Uh, are there any other games they completely switched up like this? Do you think? Oh, I can think of the top of my head. Yeah. 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 I, um, I, when it, I know when a game was from a 16-bit to 64-bit on the N64, they changed it up. What's that? Because like, uh, I remember they were making gold right, weren't they, for the SNES and stuff at the time, and then they made... Oh, were they? Oh. And Metroid was. Metroid Prime. Remember that was... Metroid! I guess that is quite a big change up because of the whole perspective, but it is very much Super Metroid again, isn't it, really? It is, yeah. Yeah, it's very similar. Not to say it's, but, like, it's great. Yeah. I'm interested to see what they do for Metroid Prime 4, though. Yeah, so, I'm really um, interested. Metroid coming back to make the game, because... But then again, it shows you just which is one of the reasons why I love Miyamoto in the sense that he says a lay game can end up being good, a bad game is bad forever. Yeah, that's true. The fact that yeah. I, like did that thing where it's like the game isn't coming up to, uh, to our standards, cancelling it, and now we're going to give it to Retro Studios. They should have been working on it all the time. Oh my god, Toby, it's a good GTA! I got a GTA map! <laughs>